if you are a normal human being, then you have some days that are not just unicorns and rainbows. Some days you actually get mad. I'm Wanda Thibodeau. I'm the host of the Faithful On The Clock podcast, and this today is Challenge Me Monday. The scripture verse that I have for you is all about resolving anger and conflict, and it is Ephesians 4 verse 26 through 27, and that says, In your anger do not sin. Do not let the sun go down while you are still angry, and do not give the devil a foothold. Now, in the business context, you know that there are going to be a lot of things that you have to resolve, and they're not easy to get through, right? Like there are really legitimate problems that take a lot of time to fix, right? Or to come to an agreement on. And so there's not going to be necessarily an overnight fix for that, but you can address the anger you feel in the day. You can say, I'm not going to stay angry, even though this, this, you know, resolution that we have to, maybe it's going to take a week or a month or maybe even more to work out all the details, right? But the anger itself, you can do something about, okay? You can still go to that person before the day closes and say, what can we do? Um, you know, you, maybe if you have to apologize, you do that, but you let that conflict go, okay? Even if you are not to an agreement yet, the anger can be released. Okay, that's what I'm getting at. So what I want you to do is through this next week, if there's any point where you are mad at somebody in your workplace because you have these things to work out and there's just like all this tension, contact that person in one way, shape or form, whether it's at the water cooler or whatever, and just say, you know, I'm sorry, or I really wanna work through this, or I'm gonna let it go for today, you know, and just let them know that there's no hard feelings for that day, just let it go, okay? and just make some peace for that day, okay? And then, guess what? If you make the peace the night before, guess how much better those negotiations are gonna go the next day? Because you, you don't have that tension anymore. You know that it's like you, you have that capacity to, to get past that, okay? And that you're not working on top of that, okay? Does that make sense, okay? So that's the challenge that I have for you. Let me know in the comments below how that goes, and I will see you next week. Bye.